we deserve the day of Eid. One quick issue that needs to be discussed. Sometimes when a death has occurred in the family during the year or in the last few months or something bad has happened, people say or think that we should not be celebrating Eid because it's the first Eid after the death of my uncle, my grandfather, my wife, my... That is blasphemous and it is a sin. Eid is a day given by Allah and Allah instructs you to in, to take it as a happy day, a day of Eid. You have to declare the greatness of Allah and enjoy that day and ensure that you have not uh, stayed back for whatever reason it may be. It's a day that Allah has blessed us with and the Prophet ﷺ has asked us and instructed us to go out for Salat al-Eid to make sure that we are happy. We congratulate each other upon a beautiful season of Ibadah. Do not stop the celebration of Eid because of the death of a person or because of a loss that you might have suffered through the year that is haram, it is prohibited and it's not allowed. You have to, uh, you have to declare what Allah has declared as a day of happiness as a day of happiness. Otherwise, you would be challenging Allah, going against the command of Allah and actually going against the decree of the Almighty. I would not like to be resurrected as a person who has gone against what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has taught and what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has asked us. So, my brothers and sisters, it is a blessed day, a beautiful day. It's about to come. May Allah grant us forgiveness before we witness the day. May He make us really be happy on that day. Remember to please Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala on that day of Eid.